evening guys uh, today I'm going to have a look at uh, venting boxes like this condensation adjustment um, trying to stop uh, condensation building up inside your boxes and ruining your insulation resistance making things rot and generally getting uh, your IR resistances to fall through the floor um, I've seen these recently which are the M12 uh, vents, they work quite nicely, but I've got no M12 holes and I don't have an M12 nut. So if I'm going to use that in my standard whisker boxes, I'm going to need to do something with that. Um, however, whisker make a vent plug, which will screw into a standard whisker box. Uh, they also make a vent gland and these will screw into a standard 20mm thread. Now those both give me an easy option um, for a little bit more money than, than these. These are quite cheap pennies. These are a little bit more money but they will save me from having to buy a either um, uh, an M12 lock nut and trying to get into a another part of my box or buying an M12 to M20 reducing bush. Um, I don't particularly like drilling extra holes in my boxes. In some places it's going to invalidate the, uh, the uh, certification on them. Um, but in this case I've got two options. So let's just see if I can give you a bit of a closer look at these. Okay so what have we got? Let me see if I can See, there is your M12 vent plug. Uh, nice, neat, small, tidy. If you can sneak them in somewhere, they're quite nice. Um, however, as I've said, I don't want to be messing around with this thread. That, to me, is a pain in the ass. Um, we need to control our condensation somehow. So, this is another offering from whisker this is the 20 mil whisker vent gland no it isn't it's the vent plug um, and it's neat and it's tidy and as I've said if I get that and screw that into my standard whisker box with the internal cut out knocked out then that's going to go flush um, they do them in white and grey I went for the black because my boxes are black uh, you've got the vents round here and if you look on the inside, there's a, uh, a, um, a membrane in there. Uh, other choice, this is the vent gland. Uh, this breathes through the side. Once you've got your cable in these slots, allow the airflow in through these holes all around the edge. Obviously, I'm not going to be using them up that way. I'm going to be hanging them out the bottom of my box at the lowest point. Same with any vent. We want it facing downwards. And these will again allow a vent a ventilation to circulate through my box. Um, another option that you can do is save these silica desiccants. Um, I buy them from um, uh, RS. Uh, they're cheap. Uh, stick them in your box uh, stick your vent gland on there as well and uh, that will give you a nice dry box and uh, the air circulation will go through uh, desiccant will take any moisture out for as long as it survives um, and they work very nicely so we have vent gland M20 vent plug M20 Whisker, and again, Whisker M12. So all three excellent products from Whisker. And uh, give yourself some options. Don't put a 3 mil hole in the bottom of the box and expect everything to be okay. Uh, it's not likely to be. Um, they will work just nicely to uh, ensure that your boxes stay nice and dry. There you go, guys.
another excellent offering from Whisker. Thanks very much and stay safe.